رسول الله رسول الله السلام عليكم I'm Yasmin Mujahid and I'm honored to be part of Celebrate Mercy's webcast about the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam when the Prophet ﷺ first got his revelation, there were two revelations that came back to back. And then there was a long period where there was no revelation, six months to two and a half years. During that time, the Prophet ﷺ began to worry. He began to worry about whether or not he really was a prophet. And he began to worry most of all about whether or not Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala was displeased with him. Now this is something I think many of us can relate to. There are periods in our life when we also worry about whether or not Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is displeased with us. We may be going through something which is difficult for us and that is our greatest concern as it was for the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Now what happened after this period of time is so beautiful because prior to this he was being comforted by his wife Khadija radiallahu anha but at this time when the next revelation came he is comforted by the creator Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala begins by saying wad duha here Allah is making an oath by his creation of the daylight wal layli idha saja and by the night when it is still now the night and the day are both creations of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and they have a physical reality but there's also a possible symbolic reality here and you see that the light of revelation is like a light on our hearts and the light of daylight here Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is swearing by it and then the night and that is like that period of time where, we, where we're disconnected from the revelation of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and you'll also see that the day and the night they are, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that they, Allah turns the day on the night and similarly the heart also turns. We know from the dua, Ya muqallib al-qulub, thabbit qulubana ala deenik, O turner of hearts, keep our hearts firm on your deen. And so like the night, which, and, and like the day and the night that turns, our hearts also turn. After making this oath, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Ma wadda'aka rabbuka wa ma qala. Your Lord has not forsaken you, nor is he displeased. So here Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is directly comforting the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And he is telling him that he is not, has not been abandoned by him, nor is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala displeased. And this is subhanAllah, this is a comfort for the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam directly, but it is also a comfort for us because during those time periods where we are going through that difficulty and maybe we are doubting whether Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is displeased, it is also a comfort for us telling us that Allah is not displeased with us. After that, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَلَلْآخِرَةُ خَيْرٌ لَكَ مِنَ الْأُولَى And indeed, verily, the last life, the hereafter, is greater than the first life, this life. And this is a reminder to the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and a comfort to the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. But it is also a reminder and a comfort for us because it tells us that we have something better coming for us inshallah in the hereafter. And this is also a reminder during those times when we are so caught up in this life and the concerns and the weight of this life that it sometimes burdens us. And this is to tell us that the hereafter, that there is a life coming that's going to be better than this and easier than this. Khairun wa abqa. It is greater and it is more lasting. And after this, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَلَا سَوْفَ يُعْتِيكَ رَبُّكَ فَتَرْضَى And Allah will give you and you will be well pleased. And inshallah, we too, when we go through those times of hardship, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has something better for us. Any time we sacrifice something for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He replaces it with something better. أَقُونِ قَوْلِ هَذَا وَاسْتَغْفَرَ اللَّهِ لِي وَلَكُمْ إِنَّهَا غَفُورٌ رَحِيمٌ وَالسَّلَامُ عَلَيْكُمْ وَرَحْمَةُ اللَّهِ وَبَرَكَاتُهُ Yeah.